Hey, I got Sean Hughes from Classic Industries in the shop with me. Sean? Dennis, how are you, sir? Nice to see you. <laughs> Always a pleasure. Look, shiny objects. Yeah, I love shiny good. objects. As do I, sir. Well, you know, these are some parts that uh, if you're going to do a restoration, you know, your bright work and stuff is something you want, you want just right. And uh, if I was doing this 20 years ago, my only option was NOS parts. Right. And now they're, they're still out there, right. but they're sort of... There's a... There's a, sp a specific line of uh, people who can actually purchase those. Yeah, I happen to live below that line, actually. <laughs> <laughs> so it's great that these are now being reproduced. And, and these are all, uh, these are OER products, and they're, they're actually licen licensed GM restoration products, yes, right? They so they're, they're, they're correct in every way, original tooling and, and all of that. Yes, sir. So now, if, if I can't afford those NOS parts, I can still... I can still have the great looking stuff. Right, and these, and these are as good looking as the NOS stuff and, and better in most cases. And, and made really uh, oftentimes in the same tooling, is that right? Correct. Okay, well let's, let's talk about some of the specifics. That's okay. got to be 69 Camaro. Absolutely. Uh, everybody notices these because that's a phenomenal car and this is a phenomenal piece to actually utilize on those. This is going to be your quarter, your quarter louver moldings. Uh, correct black insets on those, a high polished chrome on them. Uh, correct pin mounts on the back and we also sell the hardware for the mounting on these. Now that's actually a cast piece and if you correct. if you uh, had the original it wasn't in too bad a shape and you wanted to go through the replating and the, and the refinishing you could do that but right. these sill plates are something that's not so easy to do. These are thin to begin with right. and you can you can tap the dents out. Right. It takes a lot of time <laughs> <laughs> and a lot of patience. Yeah, if you it's, have that kind of patience. It's, it's so much easier to, to just replace them with, uh, with correct parts. Now, right. What do we have here? Again, Camaro? Right. We're going to have 1970 to 81 Camaro. So Gen 2. Correct. 67 to 69 Camaro. Gen 1. 62 to 67 Nova. Oh, that's a nice piece, too. Yeah. What I love about these is, this, this is fantastic, it's Body by Fisher. Yeah, these, these are correct in every way, down to the rivets that are holding them in. Oh, they are. Oh, man. It's just, it, it's like factory. Right, right. We've, we've done everything we can to make sure that you're getting exact replacement pieces. Absolutely beautiful. Now, this is going to be hood and trunk trim for something. What do we yeah, have here? This is going to be your 1964 Impala trunk molding. Okay, so it's going to actually go this way, trunk? Correct. Okay. And that one's going and, to be... And this would be for the other end of the car? Yes, sir. That's going to be your 1964 Impala hood molding. Uh, they're, heavy, they're heavy pieces. It is. Uh, the, all the correct mounting points on these as well. So one, two, three, four, five, six bolts, and I've and got a nice piece of chrome. Exactly. You have a great looking piece. Replacing my nasty old piece that was there. Eyebrow moldings? Uh, eyebrow moldings, 1966 Impala and full size uh, Chevrolet. Now these are they're they're very thin and, and right. I mean, a good size June bug right. would put a put a big dent in that. So right. it's really not worth messing around. I mean, right. if you can get the correct part, you just right. yeah. These these pieces take a, take a lot of the aggression out there at the very fore edge of the car. So I mean, mm. replace, replacing these is usually the wisest way to go. <laughs> Indeed it is. But but you got me stumped on this. What what do we have here? Well, this is going to be for all of our first-generation Camaro owners who have convertibles. They've got uh, their header molding replacements here. Oh, okay. Top, top of your windshield frame. Right. This is going to be correct for 67 so Camaro. So the, the Argent, the Silver is 67, and correct. the Chrome would and be? The, the Chrome will be 1968 and 69. Okay. Now, these really took a lot of abuse. Uh, they were always pitted. You know, they're right. Over the elements, the convertible top's coming down on top, right. and they get scratched. Right. So, again, why bother? Exactly. Uh, though, and these pieces are, are not that new on the market, but new enough that a lot of guys are going to really start clamoring after these, and these are uh, phenomenal pieces. Yeah, it's a beautiful piece. You got some other cool stuff down there. Yeah, we, I brought some other stuff with me. Uh, closest to the desk here, we've got uh, first generation Camaro. These are going to be your vinyl top moldings for, mm. for the guys who are still using the vinyl top that's, stuff. That's a lot of work. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, right in front of that, uh, another good, good piece here. This is 1947 to 1955 Chevrolet pickup truck center hood mold. Ooh, it's got a it double yeah. swoop on that. Oh, yeah. that's going to set off a restoration. Great looking piece. And out front, got to be Impala. Yep, out in the very front there, we have 1964 Impala hood lip molding. It's got the correct inlay in there. It's got all the correct mounting points. Uh, it's jewelry. That's, it, that absolutely that's jewelry is. jewelry for the automobile. Well, now, this is just a small sampling of what uh, Classic's got, right? Yeah, we actually, we actually make sure that we try and get as much as we can on the uh, early, early Camaro stuff, of course, um, all their years on that. We've got a lot of the Nova, the uh, Impala and passenger, passenger cars, and uh, the trucks. And virtually all of this is genuine GM licensed restoration parts, right? Yes, sir. So it's, it's correct tooling. It's going to fit right. just like the original. Yeah, you're going to look at correct fitment on, on almost all these pieces are going to be phenomenal fitment. And uh, you're looking at all the hardware, and we have all that as well. Bright and shiny. Bright and shiny. <laughs> Hey, if you want to learn any more about these great, genuine GM licensed restoration parts from Classic Industries, log on to myclassiccar.com. Yeah, all this bling bling here, but 
Nice rate on